All right, another day, another dollar. So the dumpster we picked up yesterday, we're gonna take this about 20 minutes up towards the mountain, but not quite up the mountain. Uh, for a switch out on another 30 they have. Uh, should be just mostly garbage in it. No, no dirt. <laughs> uh, still cleaning the dirt off of this thing. It's crazy. Anyways, um, yeah. All right, yeah, so we have to do that. We'll bring the 30, dump it at the transfer, and then we gotta go across the bridge over to Hudson, which is across the river, and uh, we got to pick up a 15 yarder that I subbed out for a 10. Hopefully, it's under one ton, but uh, if it's not, I guess I have to try to get the money from the people. But, um, you know, that's what you got to do. And that's what I was talking about. At least you could sub out a 15-yarder. If somebody needs a 10, you can sub a 15 out for it. You don't lose the job altogether. And then if it goes over, you just got to charge the people. That's the only way to do it. So... I really want to get another, I have this, this is where I've been putting my camera up here. Um, I really want to do something different. I, I, I would like to give you guys more of a view, like, like that would be cool. Like this is where you, I don't know, I'm trying to get you guys more of a view, a better view of, like, it'd be nice like my view, but I'm not going to wear a camera on my head. I mean, I could probably... That's a good view, but you can't see me shift. I don't know, I gotta work on this. Maybe up there. I don't know. I gotta work on a better view for you guys in this cab. Um, all right, so we're gonna head, we're gonna go that way and head out and uh, and see, uh, see how it goes. Really wanted to see what this thing got miles per gallon wise. But, how much is in there? Yeah, I'm just gonna fill it up. I want it to fill the, you gotta really fill two tanks and no. I guess one way to estimate it, I guess the tank's equalized. What's going on here? It's not working yet. Okay, so we're gonna, there it goes. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna fill this tank up. However many gallons this tank takes that one should be the same because this equalized last night so let's see what this takes and then we can just estimate i always want to know what this truck got miles per gallon wise so we're about to see uh, five gallons so far three, three plus all right i did 383 miles and three 36 gallons times two is 72. So let's divide this by 72 gallons. 5.3 miles per gallon. So, so five and a half miles per gallon. That's not bad considering we hauled what, 9.1, uh, yeah, 9.1 tons in that. Um, in this 30 yard yesterday and you know obviously i pretty much always have a load on this truck as you can see we got that one so i don't know i don't think that's that bad to be honest with you um so i would say if you were driving empty all the time the truck could get up to seven miles per gallon which is a, it's a tandem you know weighs 12 and a half tons empty that's pretty decent
take a look here. So let's pull in. And uh, I'm gonna have to take this, you know, we're doing a switch out now, so. I don't think there's room up here, so we're gonna look anyway. I don't think there is. I love to be able to set it right down next to this one. what you got to deal with guys look that dumpster's three foot over the top I'm gonna take some off I don't <laughs> I'm gonna take some off here I have to throw it in this one I'm not taking it down the road like that so we're gonna set this one right here And then we're gonna grab that one. We'll set that one over there in the parking lot somewhere. And uh, that's how you do a switch out. So let's do it. got stuff in front of the dumpster yeah. that's what you deal with right there so kind of show you you know what I mean look how high that is three foot over the top so this is what you got to deal with and the door is barely latched, so we got to put our safety strap on. So, all right, let's get this thing done. Look at this. I mean, this is the problem. Then I drive down the road, it all falls off.
that they were filled evenly, they would come underweight and I would make more money, so. So, what I'm going to do is, now that I'm facing this way, I guess I'm going to put this dumpster over here in this corner, because nobody's over in there, no lines overhead. So we're going to put the dumpster there, and then we're going to turn around, pick that one up, turn around again, put that one, yeah, that's what we got to do. Dumpster, tub style 30. I go too much, all everything's gonna fall off. I knew it. They overloaded it. Everything's falling off the top. Well, I ain't picking it up. tons it feels like it's hard to tell sometimes if the dumpsters are loaded say it's heavy in the front back it feels different sometimes it feels really heavy but it's not but you, you just don't know until you actually get to the dump and uh, then you'll see
usually seven dollars fifty cents for an air conditioner. I usually take it back, but I'm gonna charge it back. One mattress there. Hungry? 